Hi friends, welcome back to Table Full of Joy. I'm Cheryl and I wanted to hop on and just wish you guys a happy new year. I hope you guys had a, a great weekend. I know I did. And um, so I was gonna do this yesterday, but um, we had church yesterday morning and yesterday morning was just such an amazing way to start our New Year's off. My husband and I came home from church and we just decided to spend the day together and and just um, just being present with each other, which was super important for yesterday. So that was my focus and my focus was not on the channel yesterday. So I wanted to do that today. Um, it's been kind of a run around kind of a morning. I had Bible study this morning and trying to get some things going for some future videos that we have coming up. So I'm trying to work on all of those things, but I still wanted to get on and give you guys the um, channel update that I've been telling you guys about and just letting you guys know what we are planning for this next year. We have some amazing things, some super fun stuff coming up, and I'm super excited about it. And I hope that you guys will stick with us during this next year. You'll stick with us for all the fun things that we're going to do. Um, I, my prayer is that you guys will share this channel with your friends and your family, that you'll invite them to come and join us as well as we um, get ready to start a new year. We got this channel started late last year, so we really didn't even get a jump on it. And I just kind of was going with whatever I could could do at the point but now I have a, a vision for really where the Lord's leading this channel and that's why focus this for this year is is really to let him lead this and let him show me what it is that he wants to do with this channel so one of the big things that we have coming up for this next year is I am excited to say that we are going to be doing a huge garden this year and I can't wait for that um, we are behind the scenes we're working on the garden beds we have I think we have six last time I counted we have um we have a huge eight by eight out in our front yard that is going to be filled with flowers and herbs and all the things out there and I'm excited to be able to play with those this spring and this summer when we get those going we have um five or six beds across the backyard and those are going to be filled with all kinds of vegetables and some different fruits and more herbs and more flowers and all of these things and so we are going to be jumping into uh, bringing you guys along with us while we plant seeds and we get our stuff started and then we eventually will start planting things outside where we are here in the Pacific Northwest. We don't really get to plant outside until after Memorial Day weekend. That's usually the cutoff for us for our last frost is Memorial Day weekend. So we will have all of our stuff going on in a greenhouse kind of and we'll have all of our plants and stuff will probably be pretty good size by the time we're ready to plant so i'm excited about that i am going to start some herbs in the house in just a couple of weeks i'm going to get some herbs going because i want some fresh herbs um, now <laughs> i don't want to wait so we're going to do some plants inside so i'll bring you guys along with me as i plant those and we're going to start cooking with some fresh herbs we're going to start making some of our own seasonings this year which i'm super excited about i love to be able to make my own seasoning blends and all those kinds of things. We are getting a dehydrator and our dehydrator, um, we should have one here soon. And we're gonna use that to do all kinds of fun, different recipes um, with all of our things that we're gonna produce out of the garden over the next spring and summer. So that's gonna be an exciting thing too. Um, so with the garden and um, getting that stuff going, I am really focusing this next year on making as much at home as I possibly can and not buying anything that I don't have to at the store um, until I can get enough stuff together to start canning and getting those types of things. I do have to buy certain things at the store. But when you look at the cost of bread right now at almost $6 a loaf for the, the bread that we used to buy, which was one of our favorite breads, um, the price has skyrocketed. And I'm like, that just makes no sense to me because really um, bread is flour water, yeast, salt, and a little bit of sugar. It should not cost $6 a loaf. So I am gonna start making my own bread. Again, I'm gonna get away from buying bread at the store, doing as much as I can um, in-house. Same with our seasonings. We're gonna be doing all that stuff too. So we are gonna be experimenting with a whole bunch of different stuff this year, and I'm excited to bring you guys along with me on that. I'm excited to teach you guys some things that maybe you don't know. I'm also excited to learn some things from you guys. If you have tips, if you have um, things that you know maybe a little bit more than I do about some things, please feel free to share those things with me in, in the comments or send me a private message and let me know because I enjoy learning. That's my thing is I love learning in the kitchen. I love learning to do new things in the kitchen and that's my goal this year is to learn some new things. 
um, how to do some things in the kitchen without purchasing them um, from the store. So that is one big thing that we have coming. Another big thing that we have coming is I am going to be offering freezer meals from um, to people that want to order them. I will have certain things that'll be available and you can order those things from me and then pick them up. And these are meals that'll be complete, ready to go. You just need to put them in your freezers and they're ready for you guys whenever you need them. So I will have a list of those things available on my Facebook page. I will start leaving a link to my Facebook page in the channel when we post videos up there. I will leave a link to my Facebook page so you guys can connect with me that way. So if you're looking to order um, freezer meals, then you're able to do that from me. I'm also gonna be offering a few little um, desserts. I did some hand pies over, over Christmas holiday and it was a big hit with everybody, they loved them. So it inspired me through some of them to start making those and freezing them and then offering those to people to buy. So I'll be selling those things in a dozen, a batch, and the price on that will be coming soon. I'm gonna start updating my Facebook page over the next couple of weeks and adding those types of things in there so people can just go in and look at it. And if you wanna order something, then you're able to just connect with me and order that directly from me and we'll get it to you. So um, I'm excited about that. That is gonna be another big thing for me. Another big, huge thing, which is not gonna happen right away, but it is going to be something in the very near future, not too far, distant future, but it is gonna be happening at some point soon. Um, we are gonna be converting our two-car garage into a commercial kitchen. And once we have a commercial kitchen, I will be moving my channel to the commercial kitchen, but I'll also be doing all of my cooking out there. I'll be offering a lot more of the uh, freezer things for you guys that are interested in ordering those things. I'll be able to do a little bit more uh, on a larger scale from our kitchen at that point. And I'll bring bringing you guys along as we do all of these things from starting our garden and then starting the build on our commercial kitchen that we're gonna put in. All of those things, I wanna bring you guys along with us as we start these projects and as we progress through them, I wanna bring you guys along with us so you can see this, how this is progressing, what's happening with it, and just make this a big community event. I want you guys to be a part of this. Your support on this channel just means so much to me and I'm so blessed by every single one of you guys that join me for my recipes, that join me on my lives, that send me messages, send me comments, send me encouragement. All of those things mean so much to me from every single one of you and I hope you guys know how much it does mean to me. Um, something else that we're going to be doing on my channel, we just started doing it. Oh, let's see, we did our first one in December. And so we will start progressing this year. I'm going to try to do one a month. Um, we had my amazing friend Scott over with us and he cooked with me and then he shared his testimony. And his testimony was so powerful. I received so many amazing comments from people that just really were encouraged by his testimony and for him being able to share what God's done in his life. And I want more people to be able to do that. I want more people to be able to get their stories out there. And I really feel the Lord leading me to do that with this channel. And so once a month, I'm going to have somebody in my kitchen with me that's going to come in. We're going to cook something together and we are going to give them an opportunity to share their testimony and share what God's done with them. It's just so, it's so encouraging to me to hear what God's done in other people's lives because we all have we all have struggles. We all, we all have times in our life where we are just not really sure what direction we're going. <laughs> we're not really sure what's happening. And a lot of times getting to hear the positive things that God's done in someone's life is amazing. And being, to, being able to see how he's turned somebody's life that was going completely the wrong direction and, and not doing what God had planned for them to see him turn that around and then see all the blessings that come from following his lead. So that is super important to me and I wanna make sure that we get that on this channel as much as possible. So at least once a month, we will have somebody coming up. This um, this month on the 14th, we have my sweet friend VJ from church. She's gonna be coming with me and uh, we're gonna be in my kitchen together. We're gonna to be cooking something super tasty and um, she's gonna have a chance to share some things with you guys about what God's done in her life and that's gonna be an exciting thing. So I hope you guys will join us when we do that one. I'm not positive if we're going to do a live or if we're just going to do a regular video on that one. VJ and I are still making a decision on those things, but we'll get it figured out. We'll let you guys know for sure. The other thing that I have is a good announcement. Um, I've gotten some good feedback from our Wednesdays 
where we do a Wednesday devotional where we take a little bit of time and just really spend some time in the Word together, praying together, and um, just really seeking what God has to say for us. And so I'm going to continue that going on throughout the rest of this year. We're going to do Wednesdays. Um, I know that I started out with a five minutes with Jesus and it turns into 10. <laughs> and so that's just, you know, sometimes it happens and it's fine because the more time we spend in the word, the better. So I probably will just change that name so that people will know that it isn't going to be just five minutes. It's going to be, it's going to be a little bit more than that. Sometimes it just really depends on what the Lord lays on my heart to share with you guys. But I love that. I love being able to spend that few minutes with you guys every Wednesday and being able to open up the Bible and really share something with you that God's laid on my heart. And um, it's also a time for you guys to ask for prayer. So if you are needing prayer for something, put that in the comments because not only will I be praying for that, but anybody that reads that and that follows that uh, video will get to see the prayer request that you've put in there. And if there's a praise, share that too, because we want to celebrate with you when God answers those prayers, however he answers them, we want to share that with you. And we want to rejoice with you in the things that God's doing. So I am excited for this next year. I'm excited for what God's going to do this year with this channel, what what God's going to do in my life as far as this channel goes. And I can't wait to share all of this with you guys. And again, like I said, it means so much to me that you guys take time out of your days to watch my videos, to comment on them, to follow me on Facebook, to follow me on Instagram. Um, to do all those things. It just is such a blessing to me. And every single time that I get to read a comment from you guys, it just just fills my heart with joy. It just really does. It just makes me so happy to know that what God's laid on my heart and what he's giving me to say is speaking to somebody. And that's what I want this channel to do is I want this channel to speak to people and to hear for them to hear what God's sharing on with, with me and what he's putting on my heart to share with you guys. So that's important. And we want to make sure that through this channel, that God receives all the glory for everything that happens here. For every, for every person that sees this and it speaks to them, God receives the glory for that. And for every person that comes and shares their testimony, God receives the glory for that. And he receives the glory for every single person that hears that testimony and that he's able to speak into their life through that testimony. He receives the glory for that. And so for us going forward, this channel is going to be all about giving God the glory for every single thing that happens. No matter what it is, we praise God through everything. We praise him through the good things. We praise him through the bad things. Because even through trials and tribulations and struggles, all of those kinds of things, there's still a blessing on the other side of that. And that's, our, that's what we need to look for. We need to look for that blessing. So this year, we are going to continue to look for the blessings. We're going to continue to share the blessings with all of you as you follow us on this channel and as you continue to encourage us as we move forward and just following what God wants us to do and follow his lead. So again, I want to thank you guys so much for joining me. I hope that you'll join me as we move forward and as you um, co co hope you come along with us as we do all these fun things that we have coming up this year as we start with um, the garden and we start planting and we start working on the plans for our commercial kitchen and we start um, with all the things. <laughs> There's just so much that God has laid on my heart for this year and I'm excited to bring you guys along with us. So as I said, you guys are such a blessing to me. I hope you guys have a blessed new year. I hope that you guys will keep your eyes fixed on Jesus this year as you continue to walk with him and as you continue to move forward and just allow him to lead you. Thanks again, friends. Have a great day.